Hi guys! Welcome back to Adventures in the Schoolhouse. We are doing our author study on Jan Brett. And last week we read The Hat and had all kinds of fun crafts and activity that went with that book. And this week we are reading our beloved The Mitten. Students will be making predictions as to what they think will happen next in the story. I want Nikki to have white mittens, Asher. Because it'll get lost in the snow because it's really white. It's really right, white, that's exactly right. Say it again. You, th you think he's going to fit? Yeah? And Asher, what's your prediction? The mouse has got to win the gun. Yikes. It's a guy. You think it's going to rip? Okay, yeah, let's see. You think it might rip? When the mouse comes, that the, that the uh, mitten might rip. Okay, let's see. They could also get dirty um, from the tree. I like that prediction. And that hey, what do you think Bradley might happen now that that I think it's that tickly mouse is on that bear's nose? No, he's so got it's gonna sneeze. Yes. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Sneeze. 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 Let's see. Ready? Working on their fine motor, um, creating mittens of their own, and dressing up in their winter theme scarves and hats and mittens, just like the characters in the book. They're also going to have a fun story retell, working on number awareness and sequencing. And uh, Lennon went ahead and decided what was going to be in his mitten, right? So he said, my mitten is so big, a blank can fit in it. So Lennon chose Hedgehog. So he cut out Hedgy the Hedgehog and he glued him in. And then we went ahead and he circled all of the sight words in the sentence. And that's what you guys are going to get to do. Now if you're, if you're thinking of a animal that we didn't cut out, something like a, what are you drawing Bradley? Horse. A horse and you're going to go ahead and just draw it on your own. So Asher, what do you think is going to be in your mitten? God and Oh my gosh, I love that God's going to be in your mitten. That's amazing. That's kind of amazing. Because God is everywhere, right? Yeah. So and, he's... And angels. And angels are everywhere. You're 100% right. They're watching over us. I love that, Maisie. It is and, and, and some people, um, angels, um, they, they disguise themselves as uh, people. I love that. So Asher, if God is invisible and he's everywhere, how are you going to draw him in your mitten? I think that's perfect. That is amazing. So, all right, so you're going to draw that amazing. You, you inspired me, Asher. 